the title of this one, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. You'll see why. He does a different line, completely like daring us. So we do it. D5, F4. Now we develop. Pin him in. I want to trade any attacking piece hitting e5, even if that means giving up my good bishop. I want to hit this now. Move, pal. And he sacks. We get in. Beautiful move. Beautiful move. And now we can castle. And we're up. That's the good. This is the bad and the ugly. That was a bad move followed up by just ugly chess. He's got me trapped. We take a draw. But what if we had seen this, which we did. I don't know why I thought I was safe moving the knight. This only this only uh protects it once. He's got two others hitting it. And then if you if you think uh, when he goes back here you can go something like check. Well, no, I mean he would just he could just take and when you take check, you know, and then he's got you anyway. So there was no way out of it. But right here, why not just go right here? Threatening this. Queen B5. I don't know. I would use the A rook. Bishop C5 is what the bot. I would take. Or actually, that's. Yeah. You're getting two pieces for one. Hmm. Now what's he got? Say he goes back here. And we pick off the bishop. It's over. Yeah, this is pretty much over. So that's how we should have played it. Instead, we got a draw. What a shame. We could have done that so much easier. Just sp spotting bishop e3. Couldn't spot bishop e3. Hmm.